Armed guards stand watch outside the U.S. Embassy in Yemen, one of nearly two dozen embassies and consulates closed for the weekend due to security concerns. The top Republican on the Senate Intelligence Committee said Sunday that the measures follow what he calls the most serious threat he's seen in recent years. Senator Saxby Chambliss told Meet the Press that chatter intercepted by the U.S. was reminiscent of pre-9-11 messages. A top House Democrat on the Intelligence Committee said the messages come from high-level people in al-Qaeda in the Arabian Peninsula and were about a major attack. A top House Republican said the threat was specific as to how enormous it was going to be and also that certain dates were given. On Friday, the Obama administration announced the weekend closures largely in the Muslim world and the State Department announced a global travel alert. The statement said that al-Qaeda or its allies might target either U.S. government or private American interests. Matt Friedman, Associated Press.